I'm Dr. Scrape, and I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to protect this 600 LT McLaren front lip from driveway scrape. So this way you guys don't have to make the funny faces that I just made. You might be asking, why do I need slip low on my car? Take a look here. Look what's happening. And this is pretty much a brand new car. It's been already hit, scraped. This is probably the most uh, common um, impact point. And uh, you see this pretty much on every car. I would say this, these two, two edges right here, and then the middle is where you're gonna get the most amount of damage. Do you wanna deal with this? As you could tell, it's already starting to move to the front. So I would highly suggest putting slip low right when you get your car. You don't have to deal with this issue. You could drive your car with confidence, knowing that the car is protected. Next time you pull out our driveway, you scrape, boom, you're good. First step is always cleaning. Cleaning is the most important part, and you wanna do it correctly. I got my microfiber towel, I got my rubbing alcohol. Let's do some cleaning. Now that I'm done wiping the car, I'm gonna let it sit for a couple of minutes so the alcohol evaporates before doing the next set of prep. Now I'm gonna do my next step of prep, which is actually to prep the surface with a ProBond adhesive promoter or some type of adhesive promoter. And you might be asking, why do I need that? Or do I need it? Well, in this case, I would say yes. The reason being you got scratches, so the surface is, is very low energy and you wanna create the maximum bond possible. I personally like to use Pro bond on most surfaces uh, or adhesive promoter on most surfaces because it literally will make it bond about three to four times uh, harder than if it was just by itself. That's how powerful this stuff is. So you want something that will last you for a long, long time. Make sure you do your promoter. Now it's time to measure. Get your tailor tape out and let's do some measuring. We're gonna put this baby right there and tape it and kind of figure out exactly where our center point is. Okay. Here's some slip low. It's time to lay some down. We're gonna remove the double-sided adhesive tape. The beauty of every unit comes with its own actual 3M adhesive tape that's pre-attached to the unit from the manufacturer. So we're gonna go ahead and remove that. And make sure you always install this about an eighth of an inch back from exactly where the curve of the bumper ends. So you wanna be on a flat surface, eighth of an inch back. You don't wanna be over the curve, you wanna be behind it. That's where you get a successful install. Now we're gonna continue to this side and we're gonna cut our piece down, make sure it, 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 we get the best coverage possible. We don't wanna go over any curves. And I wanna make sure I give this part the best protection possible because as you could tell, this is the part that gets all the damage, all the hit. Now, if this car had slip low installed from the manufacturer or from the dealer, you wouldn't have the issue that you see here because that would have taken all the impact. As you can see, it's kind of moving, the damage is continuing to move up. So depending on your angle of attack and how, uh, the driveway that you're hitting, it can make a big difference which part you're gonna hit. But when you have an extra quarter inch of cushion right on the bottom here, it's gonna help drastically with minimizing damage to that part. So we could do another layer here. This is a high-end car, and I will go ahead and do a second layer right here to get the backside, even though most likely it will not hit, but in this case, I would feel better if that part is protected. We got this side done. We're gonna finish the middle and move from there.
Guys, the McLaren 600 LT is now protected with slip low. If you guys like what you see, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button below. Or if you have any questions, don't forget to comment below. Yeah, pull up on your driveway, vibing in the summer. But all you seem to get are scratches on your lower bumper. Driving two miles an hour every single day. But when you pulling out, all you hearing is a scrape. Slip low, it's a universal skid plate. Keep your Lambo or Rari protected on your drive.